Good Wednesday morning. Rain continues to fall. We've had a little more than half an inch uh, of rainfall so far, just a few minutes after 730 here on this Wednesday morning. And boy, that picture is uh, very uh, typical of what we've been seeing recently, emblematic of uh, the kind of weather we've been experiencing since yesterday when the rain started here in the Med City officially right around noon. Uh, and it's been uh, intermittently wet and wetter since then. We've had a couple of dry patches actually. Uh, the beginning of our morning newscast, it was actually dry on the weather patio for an hour or so. Uh, then the rain began to fall toward the end, and now we're uh, solidly in the wetness of that. Uh, 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 storm system as it moves through. Here's a uh, look outside from Assisi Heights. That is downtown Rochester. Kind of hard to see even in the, in the murkiness. That's our quality group camera. Uh, right now we're looking at some rain today. It'll go on for the morning especially. Afternoon looks a little less wet, but there will be some scattered showers around at least until about 3, maybe 4 or 5 o'clock. I think the rain between 3 and 5 will be coming to an end. Uh, and then by around 5, certainly 6 o'clock, we're going to be in, in the clear with drier weather. Still a little blustery. Uh, winds are going to pick up uh, for the afternoon. It's going to be actually cooler and uh, especially cooler feeling because of those winds. So don't uh, skimp on the, on, the, on the layers today. It's not going to be brutally cold, but the wind chill uh, at times this afternoon will be around the freezing mark. It's going to be uh, temperatures low 40s, but gusts around 25 to 30 miles per hour. So a little chilly, and uh, even though the rain comes in, it's still not the ideal uh, weather picture for today. So kind of a blustery and cool March day. This is what we expect this time of the year. You know, blustery, cool terms we use a lot in March. Uh, at least it's rain this time around. But anyway, rain going on. Watch the temperatures going down a little bit. We start the day. It's 46 right now. Uh, it's going to go down to about 43 by around 5 o'clock. Then eventually in the evening, it dipping down to around 40 around midnight and then we'll see uh, the temperatures get to around the freezing mark by tomorrow morning but drier weather certainly uh, for tonight and tomorrow morning. Uh, here's a look at outside uh, in Rochester. It's 46 degrees. It feels like 41. The wind's out of the south now, 10 miles per hour. Air pressure is steady, 29.45 inches of mercury. That's a low number, and that tells us low pressure is nearby. And of course, that is what's generating these clouds and showers. 46 in Rochester, Mesa City 44. It's 48 in Winona and Decorah 46. And here's what we're looking at on uh, satellite radar. There's a storm system hovering in space. Space. It's slowly working its way across the map. Hopefully the, the radar comes up here before too long. Uh, we're looking at a, a few showers in the neighborhood. Uh, here's future track watching that storm system move through northern Wisconsin. Rain comes in end between 3 and 5. Tonight a drier evening, a breezy evening, but the winds then drop off after midnight. Tonight into tomorrow, maybe a break or two in the clouds, but otherwise we'll wait until tomorrow during the mid-morning hours to really see a, a decent amount of sunshine and clearing skies. And a lot of sun tomorrow afternoon, a light northeast breeze, high temperatures tomorrow around 46, 47. We're talking mid, maybe upper 40s. And similar situation Friday, light breeze, a lot of sunshine. Watching a storm system coming in from the west that eventually will bring a chance of a very widely scattered light rain showers Friday night. Perhaps starting as early as 8.30, 9 o'clock in the evening. So if you have evening plans outside, you know, maybe a bonfire or something like that, you may encounter some showers Friday night. If you're thinking, hey, it's uh, Saturday, looks like a balmy day, it's going to be a little wet. We have to often on showers with occasional sunshine in store for Saturday. It's Sunday, by far the sunnier and more pleasant of the two days for this weekend. Today, look for 47. That's morning high temperature in Rochester, 48 Austin. Uh, Lacrosse 53 winds northwest by this afternoon at times reaching 20 gusting around 30 miles per hour. Uh, uh, kind of a breezy, cool day. Light showers about another quarter inch or so in the way of rainfall possible uh, by early afternoon on top of the half inch or so we've seen already. So still a chance to get as much as three quarters of an inch of rain overall from the storm system. Drier weather this evening, a little breezy still until after midnight. The winds then drop off. Low, lows around 32 by tomorrow morning. And then some partly sunny conditions, increasing sun in fact going into the afternoon. Uh, fairly tame northeast breeze around 10, 12 miles per hour. 46 uh, your high temperature for your uh, Thursday and the outlook for Friday and the weekend. We do have some sun until some scattered showers develop Friday evening and then Saturday often on rain and sun uh, and uh, a fairly light breeze. Sunday just a slight uh, amount of wind and extra sunshine highs around 52. Beyond that, it does get a whole lot warmer early next week. Monday, breezy, warm day, 60, a chance of showers, just a couple of those late Tuesday into early Wednesday of next week. And looking ahead, I was looking at some of the data toward the end of next week, it does look like we may see 
another shot at the 50s and maybe even 60 by the time we get to Good Friday, the end of next week, heading into Easter weekend. Not promising a perfect Easter weekend because it does look like there may be some showers around part of that weekend, but temperatures do look at least pretty decent. No eight inches of snow at this year round like like we had last year in Easter. It does look like we're going to have a much warmer situation uh, for the most part. So that's something to get kind of excited about uh, for this particular uh, setup. Anyway, in the meantime, uh, stay dry today uh, and uh, enjoy this above freezing weather. It's still uh, yeah breezy and cooler today, but still uh, colder than some of the weather we had last week when we had all that snow. I, I'm still uh, enjoying uh, more spring than winter in uh, my late March uh, forecast picture here. In the meantime, have a great day. We'll see you back here on Thursday.